Everybody have a PC? Yep. Of some type or Mac? Mac you no? Mac. Oh Mac yeah. users? Mac. Yeah. Mac. Macs. Mac. Um, <laughs> Mac users, uh, you what I'm about to say this is based on PCs and Mac users have to do all this manually. So um, to keep your hard drive running for Mac users, for keep your hard drive running uh, your computer running good, you need to regularly run your disk utilities because it loses the chain. The, it loses the chains, and what I mean by change is per, you can lose permissions for certain sectors on your hard drive. So you have to regularly run your disk utilities and repair the permissions. For PC users, you can automate that. Um, it's recommended that you run run your maintenance once a week, depending on how you use it. If you use it a couple of times a week, no big deal. But for a business, you should automate those. There's a, a, a couple of items that you can use. Disk cleanup, disk defragger, disk check, and checks for uh, disk cleanup, cleans up all the temporary files. You can get rid of all the temporary files. Disk defrag, um, does, does everybody understand what disk defrag is? No. Okay. <laughs> As we all know, the disk is, in, is round. Right. right? That's divided into sectors. Okay? Each sector is a piece of the pie. Well, if a file is a 100K file, it writes it into one sector. Normally, sectors are broken up in by 12K blocks. So that extra 412K is blank. What it does, it defrag optimizes all those little pieces and puts them all together. It makes your drive run faster, um, more efficient, and keep the, it keeps the life, uh, extends the life of the hard drive. This cleanup is cleans up all the uh, all the temporary files. Check disk. Check disk checks for bad sectors. Don't worry about it, Kathleen. Max, don't do that. No, I have them both. Oh, okay. <laughs> and if you would like, um, if if you would like um, steps on how to do these, leave me your card here on the table, and I'll I'll email it to you. Um, check disk checks for bad sectors on the drive, and actually moves the data. If it finds a bad sector on your drive, it moves the data from a bad one to a good one, marks that bad, so no no data can get in there. Bless you. Uh, scheduling. You want to schedule these in Task Scheduler. That's located under System Tools. You can schedule each one of these. There's some defaults in there that most people don't understand or, or um, know where to find them. Let your computer do the work for you. You're not using it at night. Let it run. Turn your monitor off. The money that you will spend in electricity for an average computer is a dollar, dollar and a half a month in electricity versus leaving it and leaving it off or having to pay somebody to come out and fix it. 